Hi and welcome. This is the very first video tutorial for the 8051 microcontroller series. And uh, in this tutorial, I will discuss the basic requirements related to the software and hardware. This tutorial series will be based on Atmel's 889S52 microcontroller. You can also prefer the microcontroller from Philips. If I consider the required softwares, then I will use Micro C Pro for H051, this C compiler, to write the programs for S52 microcontroller in C language. And on the other hand, I have Keel Microvision version 5 to write the programs in assembly as well as C. So whenever I need to develop a code in assembly language I will prefer to use this Keel Microvision software. On the other hand to simulate the H051 microcontroller behavior I have Proteus ISIS installed. This is version 7.10. You can use any compatible version for Windows 7 or 10. To transfer the hex file into microcontroller I am going to use this prog ISP software which is also useful to program the Atmel's AVR microcontrollers as well as it also support 889S52 microcontroller. I'm going to refer Atmel's 889S52 datasheet. Along with this I have this book for 8051 microcontroller written by Muhammad Ali Mazidi. It is a very handy PDF available online which can deliver a great insight to the microcontroller. I have links to download the required softwares and uh, PDF files. Uh, first of all you can download C51 Keel Microvision software from this given link. I will add the links in the description. Uh, you need to fill the details while downloading this C51 compiler and to download the micro C compiler we have to go to this link and click on this download button. Keel Microvision and Micro C Pro for 8051 both are paid software but I will tell you how to crack these two softwares. To download the 8051 book by Mazidi you need to search here in the Google and you will get this first link to PDF. Download this PDF. To download the datasheet for 889S52 you have to search for these keywords and click on this second PDF link to download the datasheet of microcontroller. For this video tutorial series I have to consider the basic hardware and I have this 8051 development board. It is a custom made PCB and you can see I have mounted a microcontroller 889S52 here uh, with all the required outputs on the both side of this microcontroller with a crystal and uh, here on the upper side I have this power supply for uh, microcontroller and this port, uh, and this socket is to mount the LCD and I have few push button inputs and few LEDs for output. I will use this development board to test all my codes on hardware. I can program the microcontroller with the help of these pins MOSI, MISO, SCK, RST and Crown. I have these female to female jumper wires to connect the input and outputs of the microcontroller to the hardware uh, such as I can connect any pin of the microcontroller to any peripheral with the help of these female to female jumper wires. To power up this board I have a power adapter with 
this rating I have 12 volt 2 ampere DC adapter and this is the connector which I can connect to the development board this outer metallic part is negative and the inner metallic point is positive we need to upload the hex file generated by the compiler to the microcontroller and for this purpose I have this USB ASP Pro programming device uh, this device is actually for AVR microcontrollers but it can also program 889S52 microcontroller uh, we have a connector here with the same pins MOSI, MIS, OSCK, RST and ground to connect this programming device to laptop I have this USB cable one side is type A connector and other side is type B connector so we can connect this programmer to our laptop or PC so guys in the next tutorial I will discuss how to install the required softwares and uh, how to configure them to start the programming for H051 I will also discuss the basics of 8051 microcontroller such as its assembly instructions and other peripherals. So for now thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe the channel.